Man, listen. This shit crazy. This shit, hey, I just watched this. I just watched this little thing on fight hype about Terrence Crawford calling himself trying to tell his part of the story. That's some bullshit. He lying like a motherfucker. All the people that you just mentioned, I hope they do go and go and ask them, cause they gonna tell you what happened. I was, you heard what he said. I was the prima donna. What that mean was, I was that guy. I was that guy. And they said a prima donna is somebody that's supposed to be real good, but don't amount to nothing or something. I was that good. I was that guy. Terrence Crawford, he never, he was a, he was number, he was my, what was, what was Terrence? I'm going to say two, three, number two or three. He was never in the upper echelons when we was in the, when we was in the, uh, uh, in the amateurs. He was never that, that real number one guy. Nobody ever ran the sport of uh, uh, the amateurs other than me and Rashi Warren. Ask all the people that he just named. Me and Rashi Warren. And yeah, I work with Mark Davis. Mark Davis ain't motherfucking get out on me. I was that guy. Mark cool. Mark Davis cool. I hope y'all, I hope, I hope they do go and ask Mark Davis. Mark, I'm going to give you an opportunity to be a real nigga, bro. I'm going to give you an opportunity to do some real shit. You know what I'm saying? The most Mark can say was that it was good work at its best. Nobody would never say that anybody got out on me in the amateurs. Couldn't nobody fuck with me. When we when we competed in the amateurs, it would be three rings. It would be three rings fighting at one time. It'd be three rings, three rings fighting at one time. If me or Rashi won four, I don't care who was in the arena. The whole entire arena would leave the other two rings and come and watch us fight because we was the ones that was always the guy. We was always that dog, man. Me and Rashi won was the only ones that ran everything. I was always the number one. I was always the number one in every tournament, every year. Ask Terrence Crawford was he able to do that. He ain't make the Olympic team because he couldn't make it with the best of the best. He had to turn pro before everybody else to try to get a head start or something because he couldn't make it. He ain't make the Olympic team because he wasn't good enough. He was the number two, number three. Them that them guys were flip-flop. They were flip-flop. Maybe they have a good week. Maybe they have a good day. I always had a good week. I always had a good day. It's a difference. Ain't nobody capping. Get the fuck out of here, Terrence. Try that shit with somebody else. Every time I hear you say my name or say something slick, I'm on your ass. Stop playing. Stop playing. Yeah, we did have words. Tell them what really happened. You turned to a sucker, man. That's crazy, man. Tell everybody what really happened. I'm, I'm glad you saving face. You know what I'm saying? And and everybody everybody think you will beat me. Everybody think you will beat me. So let's get the fans what they want to see. Since you can beat me and you this and that and all that, make the fight. Let's make something happen. I will meet you at 147. I will fuck you up. Come on, man. This shit is crazy. Play them games with somebody else, Terrence. You know what it is, man. You know what it is. Tell, tell somebody, tell whoever on your team or do whatever you got to do to come holler at me. You got people in your camp that got my contact information personally. Personally. We don't got to do no social media. We don't got to do none of this. Tell them to make the fight happen. Tell them to call me. Let's figure out a way. You know what I'm saying? We know it's a whole lot of politics. It's a whole lot of politics that's watering the sport down. You know what I'm saying? Let's, they say, to keep it 100, they say me, you, and Earl Spence, the realest boxers in the sport of the game. Let's really do some real shit and cross the bridge and take, and take away the politics and the bullshit and get the fans what they want to see. You, since you feel some type of way, fight me. Since you feel some type of way about what really happened, fight me. You was a sucker. Stop playing, man. I ain't a, and guess what? I ain't even gonna put it out there. But I do remember walking up the bleachers on you. Come on, man. Stop playing. Ask, I hope y'all do ask the people. Go and go and go and talk to the people that he mentioned. Definitely Mark Davis. Mark Davis more importantly. Mark Davis more importantly because nobody nobody couldn't fuck with me. If anything, we had good work at its best. Ain't nobody get the fuck out on me. Ain't nobody get out on me. I was always that guy. Come on, man. Play these games with somebody else. You try to go ahead and manipulate the people. You can't manipulate me, Slim. Stop this shit. Fuck out of here. Hold up, man. Hey, this shit crazy. 
This shit crazy. Now y'all got Terrence Crawford coach. Somebody who wasn't up there at the Olympic Training Center talking about I snuck him. Terrence, stop this shit, man. Stop this shit. You came to me. You was talking reckless out your mouth. Very aggressive. You got punched in the fucking face. You acting, you, you, you got punched in the fucking face. They made you the pound for pound. Uh, you supposed to be pound for pound. If you a fucking fighter, if you got punched in the face, you got punched in the face and grabbed your mouth. You grabbed your face. Then people came in between. Don't act like you 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 attempted to fight back. Stop faking. You supposed to be a, a, a world class uh, fighter from the pound for pound list. Don't counter punch and count for something. You should be able to take a shot and fire something right back in response. That's what boxers do. You like, come on, man, get the fuck out of here. Don't try to spin in and act like somebody snuck you. You came to you came to me. You came to me. And I asked questions when I answered your question. When I answered your question, you 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 you, you want to do all this loud yelling, rough tough like you like you about that life and I punched you in the fucking face. That's it. That's all. You grabbed your mouth. Stop faking like somebody like we bait jumped in, broke it up. I'm not one of them suckers, shorty. Stop playing with me, Terrence. You know what time it is, man. You know me from the amateurs. You know how it is, man. Don't play them games, man. I just wanted to let y'all know what really happened because you got people out here trying to save face, acting like where well, he snuck him, he did this. Ain't nobody sneak you. Ain't nobody sneak you. You came to me asking questions, getting reckless out the mouth. What, you thought I wasn't going to punch you in the fucking face? You tripping. Play them games with somebody else, man. I just had to come on here and say that, man. And his coach wasn't even there. He don't know what the fuck happened. Ask everybody else what happened. Ask all the all the people that's in that's competing in the sport of boxing right now that was there that seen what happened. Ask them. How about the reporters going holler at Saddam Ali? How about one of the reporters going holler at holler at uh 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 go going holler at um Demetrius Andrade? You know what I'm saying? How about the reporters go and holler at one of them and ask them what really happened? Since just since this, since motherfuckers lying and y'all the ones bluffing. Stop this, man. I've been a monster since I was a youngin. I've been a monster since I was a dog. Ask my man, ask my man Andre Berto about me. He a good friend of mine now. Everybody know Andre Berto. That was my guy. Good friend of mine. But he'll tell you I've been a dog. I could tell this story. I could tell this story about me and Andre Berto because he tell it. He telling his damn self, you know what I'm saying? I be telling him not to tell nobody this shit. But he do anyway. You know what I'm saying? But when we was in the amateurs, and I was in the silver gloves, when we was 8, 9, to 10 years old, Andre Berto beat, my, beat one of my friends up. I got mad and caught him in the bathroom. And caught him in the bathroom and sent him out the bathroom crying. But we friends now. We friends now, that's my man. But I'm just letting you know that the pedigree's been here. I've been a monster since, since a youngin'. Turn, stop playing. Stop faking like it's not like it's not real, shorty. Ain't nobody sneak you, man. Ain't nobody sneak you. Shouldn't have came to another grown ass man talking reckless with a whole lot of hostility in your mouth. That's that's not how people do business, man. Walk up to me. You like uh? Man, what you think about the spawn, man? He was running, right? I'm like, well, we 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 boxers. You know what I'm saying? He we supposed to hit and not get hit. He was moving, but he was moving with a purpose. Mm. So he 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 ain't like what I said and got the frown on his face and yelling and all that. I'm not gonna go back and forth with another grown ass man. So he got his shit split. Mm. It was only one punch thrown. It was only my punch thrown. He got shipped the fuck off to Sports Med to go get his shit checked out. <laughs> Point blank period. Damn. You know what I'm saying this uh, that's not it's not a rumor. This some factual shit. Mm. This some factual shit. All that shit that Tank talking. He wish he can catch me. In the closed room and all that. Stop playing, Shorty. Don't make this shit mm. personal. Mm. Don't make it personal. It's business, but don't make it personal. You done seen me knock niggas out from your gym. You done see, you done heard about me fuck people up from mm. your gym and all that. Like, come on, man. I've been mm. a menace out here. Stop it, Shorty. Mm. Stop it, Shorty. <laughs> Stop it. But nah, it's it's not a rumor. There's some factual shit. Uh-huh. You know what I'm saying? Shit. What if he if he, Put it like this: If 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 Terrence feels some type of way about it, if he don't got to fight, I fight him. He can get that shit back. What's up? You'll fight Terrence. Up, Terrence? Thirty-seven. You'll Fuck fight. Yeah, I fight. Fuck yeah, I'm a I'm a cold man. Once again, I'm a right now. I'm probably like one thirty-eight, one thirty. This is Don Marlene. You watch Aki TV. This is Richie Comet. Keep watching Aki TV. Subscribe.
Huh? Alle Tweety, free bacon, egg and cheese after my fight. We here with Achi TV. You know we out here. Huh? That's what you get if you yes, don't subscribe, sir. huh? Subscribe, like, you already know, comment. Huh? Yeah.